The European Free Trade Association, EFTA, is a regional trade organization and free trade area consisting of four European states, Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway, and Switzerland. The organization operates in parallel with the European Union, EU, and all four member states participate in the EU single market. The EFTA was established on May 3, 1960 as an alternative trade bloc for European states who were unable or unwilling to join the then European Economic Community, EEC, which subsequently became the EU. The Stockholm Convention, establishing EFTA, was signed on January 4, 1960 in the Swedish capital by seven countries, known as the Outer Seven. Today only two founding members remain, Norway and Switzerland. The other five were Austria, Denmark, Portugal, Sweden and the United Kingdom. The initial Stockholm Convention was superseded by the Vaduz Convention, with the aim of providing a successful framework for continued expansion and liberalization of trade among the organization's member states and with the rest of the world. While the EFTA is not a customs union and member states have full rights to enter into bilateral third country trade arrangements, it does have a coordinated trade policy. As a result, its member states have jointly concluded free trade agreements with a number of other countries. To participate in the EU's single market, Iceland, Liechtenstein and Norway are party to the agreement on the European Economic Area e with compliance regulated by the EFTA Surveillance Authority and the EFTA Court. Switzerland instead has a set of bilateral agreements with the EU. British reaction to the creation of the European Economic Community was mixed and complex. Britain was also preoccupied with the Commonwealth, which, at the time of EFTA's formation, was in transition. Britain therefore brought together several countries including some bordering the EEC, to form the European Free Trade Association soon after the establishment of the six-nation EEC, France, West Germany, Italy, Belgium, Luxembourg, and the Netherlands. On January 12, 1960, the Treaty on European Free Trade Association was initialed in the Golden Hall of the Prince's Palace of Stockholm. This established the progressive elimination of customs duties on industrial products, but did not affect agricultural products or maritime trade. The main difference between the early EEC and the EFTA was the absence of a common external customs tariff, and therefore each EFTA member was free to establish individual customs duties against, or individual free trade agreements with, non-EFTA countries. Despite this modest initiative, the financial results were excellent, as it stimulated an increase of foreign trade volume among its members from 3.5 to 8.2 billion US dollars between 1959 and 1967. This was rather less than the increase enjoyed by countries inside the EEC. After the accession of Denmark, Ireland and the UK to the EEC in January 1973, EFTA began to falter. For this reason most countries eased or eliminated their trade tariffs in preparation to join the EEC, but experienced declining revenue which reduced the importance of EFTA. Citation needed clarification needed, four members remain, Switzerland, Norway, Liechtenstein and Iceland. The interactive free trade map gives an overview of partners worldwide. Portugal Fund The Portugal Fund was established in 1975 when Portugal was still a member of EFTA, to provide funding for the development of Portugal after the Carnation Revolution and the consequential restoration of democracy and decolonization of the country's former empire. This followed the period of economic sanctions by most of the international community which had left Portugal economically underdeveloped compared to the rest of Western Europe. When Portugal left EFTA in 1985 to join the EEC, 
The remaining EFTA members decided to continue the Portugal Fund, so that Portugal would continue to benefit from it. The fund originally took the form of a low-interest loan from the EFTA member states to Portugal, to the value of 100 million US dollars. Repayment was originally to commence in 1988, but EFTA then decided to postpone the start of repayments until 1998. The Portugal fund has now been dissolved by the member states of EFTA. Mm.